Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I made a video almost kind of like this, and then my mentor was inspired by my video, and he made one, and he, he added to it, so I thought I would show. When you have something, you, here's your duplicate distance and your nudge distance. When you have something selected, it goes away. Well, if you want it to be, always be there, if you will hold down the control and the alt button and bring it in, and then you can actually hold down the control and the alt button again and bring it to you, get that line, it'll add it to it, put it in one toolbar. Now that's pretty cool and you can get it back whenever you want it, but if you want to name it, and that's what he uh, did today. So we're gonna to go to option customization command bars and there it is right there, number six. If you will click on the name twice and then just start typing Now you've named it, and when you hit OK, you've named it Duplicate and Nudge. So whenever you want that, if you want, and you could park it up here, but if you don't want it all the time, all you have to do is click on your toolbar and go down to Nudge and Duplicate, and it'll bring it up. So it's there that you can use it anytime you want. This really helps a lot when you're wanting to do something, and instead of when you click on something, when that goes away, well, if you want to be able to change your duplicate distance while you're clicked on it, you have it right there and it's always there. You can just right click, nudge a duplicate, and there it is. I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.